Hi everyone, welcome to Max Art Place. I'm Marlene Kosan. Middle initial is A, and that's how I get Mac. I saw a Dutch pour that Canela Sirocco has done, and I liked the idea, so I'm going to try something similar like that, but I'm going to do something called a double Dutch. I'm gonna to try to do a Dutch going around a circle and another one in the center of the circle going on top of that, so we'll see what happens. My base is a white paint from Dollar Tree. I wanna see how that works. It's called Rich Art Acrylogily Premium Acrylic Paint. I've mixed it with some Floetrol and a little bit of water. I think it's still a little thick, but we'll see. And the colors that I'm going to use, I've mixed up some um, Bling It, the uh, Extreme Pastel Lights, and I'm using a Sea Goddess and Firefly, and I mixed them with my pore medium of three parts Vivid Enamel and two parts Polyprylic. And I have Montmartre's Fellow Green, and I have mixed up a blue-green myself, and it's one-to-one -one with Floetrol. My purple is a deep violet with Floetrol from Liquid uh, Basics, and DecoArt's Peacock Pearl, uh, Peacock Metallic Teal from DecoArt. I have my gold mica powder, and I have this light green, Arteza yellow green, Floetrol three to one. So um, we'll see if I use all of them or some of them or what. But uh, I'm gonna pour in a circle. I have my white base on already. So I'll take you down. And I remembered my gloves. Well, we, so let's see, what color do I wanna put on first? I think I'll use some of this, uh, I wonder if I want to do, I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm going to do like this. I want to leave space in the middle uh, to do my second one over that. And there's my purple. And I'm going to do my light green on top of that. And then I'm going to do the interference that I mixed up. The bling it on the green. Green, green. And then we'll use some of this. And some of this one. I lost the lid. Had to put tape on it. It's got a little something stuck in it. And I used the purple, and we'll use this blue-green that I mixed up. I wonder if it needs a little bit of more purple. It's got a lot of greens and blues in there. Well, we'll try it and see what happens. I like the way purple comes out. Oh, we didn't use the gold, so might as well use a little bit of gold. Okay, here comes the noise. Always forget something. White paint. I want to put some more white paint in the center. It's hard to pour from a large bottle.
Before I go on to the next round, I want to add, I think these would be better on a round uh, canvas, but I don't have a round. And I want these here to go a little bit further in the corners. So I'm gonna see what this does. This is Amsterdam white. place around in my circle which I didn't do so we're just trying to make this where I like it and I didn't use any silicone which probably would have given me some more cells but also this gold might help that spot needs to be fixed this is how we learn Okay, I'm back. So what I want to try here is I better put some white paint down first. Right in the middle. Sloppy, sloppy, sloppy. And I'm going to pour around this white paint. This is what will be my Dutch, double Dutch, like the old skipping rope. 
Hope it works out. And if it don't, it don't. That's how you learn. Purple's on the bottom. I'll do a little more purple. And a little more gold. And this bling it. Now we'll give that a try. What happens when you work in small areas, you drop things. giving me some cells which I like and I kind of like this purple thing in the middle there well guys let me know what you think and I'll put the description down below and I hear my dog barking out there and uh let me know what you think, a yay or a nay. I really appreciate my new subscribers and keep listing more and more and tell your friends and give me a thumbs up and that'll really help me move forward with my channel. And I really appreciate everybody. And don't forget to hit the bell so you know when I list a video. And my email address is maxartplace at gmail. So you can let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. Well, here's a close up. Mm. You see, I got some nice cells there. Nice coloration there. This paint, the second one that I blew on there might be a little thick. So hope it doesn't crack but it was a nice experience and I think what would be good to do is try different colors for the ones that you do in the middle that's interesting there I do like that line of purple in the middle there it's interesting so there's the whole thing again thanks for watching